first she sat me down she said Tawana I may have you a kidney and I said what and she said yeah she said but it's not a human kidney it's a pig kidney I said okay she said that's a lot of risk because this is new research new ground that hadn't been explored yet She's received the transplant at just the right time before we get into the really long-term morbidity of dialysis. Um, and this is really the only possibility for her to have a transplant. Okay, thanks. I didn't have any other options. This was my last option due to the fact that my blood had 100% antibodies. So that left me not able to accept a human kidney. And basically what that means is it's really, really hard, almost impossible to find a completely compatible transplant. Uh, and we had tried everything. Started talking to Miss Looney about uh, a pig kidney. And now I'm taking the clamp off the artery and it should be <laughs> yeah. nice and pink. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> it's yeah it is. <laughs> Gorgeous. <right. laughs> it looks beautiful. It was remarkable. Uh, the kidney pinked up and looked just like a human kidney. It made urine within just a few minutes. And by the time we saw her that evening, we all noticed it. It's this miraculous change that these patients get after a transplant. They get this rosiness in their cheeks. They look alive. And she continues to do fabulous and I think is really enjoying uh, having a kidney that works. Um, thank you for not giving up on me. Never. <laughs> Never. We said we were in it to win it, didn't yes, we? Yes, we did. Didn't we pinky swear? Yes. Did we, we, we did. did. I think we did. I think we did. <laughs> Just the feel of the blood flow in my body it was amazing. The energy I had was amazing. To have a working organ and to feel it, it's unbelievable. When you had not urinated in seven and a half years, I feel like I got a second chance on life.